Demonstration of a Jacob's Ladder with a 900 watt, 15,000 volt, 60 milliamp tra neon transformer. Add to that a neon bulb, causing the thing to light up. Can't do it for very long on either end because I run the risk of actually melting the plastic inside the bulb. Try another little demonstration, which is to plug a wire into one end. The arc will still go off, but I can actually manipulate it with the wire and move it wherever I want. Oh, that was the rubber. That was the plastic catching on fire. Plasma's carrying a lot of heat. As a matter of fact, if you look close, you can actually see the copper in some places glowing red from the temperature. Only on the small wire. The large wire can take a significant amount of abuse. This is actually six gauge copper wire bought at Home Depot. Now quickly I'm going to remove the leads. This box has a aluminum has a set of aluminum couplings at the top so that I can swap out electrodes fairly quickly. if you're demonstrating a number of different tests, especially in front of a bunch of fifth graders. Now to keep it from spreading the boats to the other side like this, you can put an insulator in the middle and that actually stops that. And the arc actually spreads throughout the coupling, which is pretty cool looking. Generating a lot of heat, I'm actually melting some of the plastic that's insulating this. 